what was that game like just from the beginning? In the first period, you guys had a bunch of chances before you eventually did score. Uh, yeah, it was up and downs this game. Uh, I thought we in the beginning, first ten, we played good. Then they they played better, and we we stopped skating. And the second ten, there in the first period, and then they got a little momentum. But then then we we played better after that, I think. And then it was still up and downs in the second period too. But then we played good in the third period. But I think it's up and downs. We need to be more. Uh, we need to be. Like playing better, a lot of minutes out there. I think that's uh, that's the key for for next games. But I think uh, we found a way to win, and that's the most important thing. How hard is it to stay focused? I think your shift was a, the goal on your shift was chaotic, and then all of a sudden, boom, out of nowhere, you're right in the right place at the right time. Yeah, I just try to be at the right place. I know when Rad said the puck, he, he's he's gonna find me. So, uh, yeah, like you said, it was uh, was a shift there. Uh, but uh, I just uh, try to go to the net, and I know that good things happen if I go there. And uh, Rad found me there, so it was uh, it was nice to get a goal. <clears throat> As a player, is it more fun to play in these type of games where it's physical and the emotion is just automatically high? Yeah, it is uh, actually. It's I like those games, and it's it's easier for to get the emotions when it's that type of game. So. Uh, yeah, I like playing those games, and uh, it's uh, I, I like when it's physical. You guys have done a good job of recovering when you give up a goal in the final minute or so. How do you read structure, and how do you you know start over time? And Stay focused, I guess. Yeah, I think that's important, and uh, yeah, we we know that we we done it before. Uh, that's uh, that's important too, and we we got the confidence when when we know they score, we we know we can get back at them uh, and and play good after after a goal again. So, so I think that's uh, that's a confidence in the group that we have, and it's important moving forward. What's it like having a teammate like Jamie on the team? He just mentioned a bit ago how much he loves you guys, and we've seen the past few games you know, he's willing to stick up for you guys. What's it like having him as a leader on this team? Uh, that's so important. It's huge for us. I think he that, that he did that turn the game for us. It's so important to to have a guy like that, and he's the captain too. So it's he's leading the way, and for for a young kid like me, it's it's a pleasure to see him see him play and see him do that. So yeah, yeah, I, I, lo I love him. We we need him. Where do your your communication with rats is that verbal communication or are you just reading off of him and his play or where where does that develop from? Uh, I think yeah, we learn the more we play, we learn to to read of each other. Uh, I think that's that's a big key, and then communication too. Uh, we're talking a lot, so I think that's that's a key too.